For the sake of argument to play devil's advocate, James Krause did nothing wrong. If he has insider knowledge that all but guarantees that a certain outcome is gonna happen and he can use that information to make money for him and his family, he'd be stupid not to capitalize on that. He'd be evil not to capitalize on that to provide for his family. And why should the casinos be the only ones allowed to win? Who cares if the casinos lose a couple times? In the long run, the house always wins, so who cares if in the short term, the Krause always wins? The scummy casinos will be fine because they they have the game rigged to their advantage and take advantage of addicts throwing their life savings and life in general down the drain. Who cares if they lose a couple bucks off a prelim fight here and there? And if Krauss was selling this information to people for money, good for him. This just proves that he provided an extremely valuable service to his customers because all the money coming in was for a first round stoppage win for Shylan, and that is exactly what happened. In this case, Krauss was an extremely honest businessman who provided perfect customer service delivering the exact results that his clientele paid for. We need more businessmen and women to deliver on their promise to their customers. We need more professional business owners like James Krause. For the sake of argument, anyone else defending James Krause or any other takes on this, let me know in the comments below.